Okay, now this x squared minus r doesn't look anything like these two. But if we consider that we could have x minus 4, x plus 4 on the bottom fraction, that would end up becoming x squared minus 16. So what we need to try and do is firstly, with the 2 over x minus 4, get an x plus 4 on the bottom. And the way to do that is multiply by this fraction here, x plus 4 on the top and the bottom. And then with the other side, I need to multiply by an x minus 4 on the top and the bottom. So with my big long fraction, that's going to be x minus 4 times x plus 4 for both of them. And then I just need to do some multiplying out. So with this thing here, I've got a 2 times an x and a 2 times a 4. That gives me 2x plus 8. And with this one, I've got a minus 3 times an x, which is minus 3x, and a minus 3 times a minus 4, which is plus 12. So minus 3x plus 12. Now I count up what I've got. The R is 16. The X is 2 minus 3, which is minus 1. And the constants are 8 plus 12, which is 20.